A small Kanata park where people walk is being guarded by a very territorial bird. It tries to attack any passerby who dares cross its path. And as CTV's Dave Charbonneau found out firsthand, this bird means business. You just have to be on your guard every time you take a walk along this path. This is Pete. Pete doesn't like people. Every spring, there's a red-winged blackbird that swoops down, that uh, <laughs> swoops down at everyone who walks by. For years, Pete has been attacking anyone who gets in his way. <laughs> Yesterday, we were walking along the path. We saw the bird. He didn't attack at that time, so I thought, let's, let's try this out. So I turned around and walked back, and he swooped down, and I had to fight him off. It was, it was, it was brutal. <laughs> this bird does this every year. We think that if you stare at him, uh, there's safety in numbers, and more eyes on him means you can escape unscathed. It's very territorial. I mean, <laughs> I, 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 incredible. Residents in the area have even put up signs. It's not like you hear fluttering of wings. It's more like a it's more like a snake coming right at your head. Warning: There's danger from above. You duck, you start running, and then you usually hear this hissing. But is it really as scary as people say it is? It couldn't be, could it? Oh, Bird psycho. Recently, I was biking by on a bike, going pretty fast. And I'm just looking down and I see my shadow and I see the bird's shadow just coming right in on me. Experts say the attacks are most likely due to a nest nearby that Pete is protecting and he's doing a good job of it. And they're all along this creek. Just this one has a vendetta for anyone who comes near its home, it seems like. And my son puts his helmet on and rides yeah. his bike by and gets pecked on the head. He loves it. So if you find yourself walking down this path in Canada, just know that you might be running for your life from Pete the red-winged blackbird who owns this trail. It's good to know that I'm not the only one that he's speaking on. <laughs> Dave Charbonneau, CTV News.